Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, Emily's Deals in Steals. Thanks for watching this video today. If you're new, make sure to hit that red subscribe button um, so you don't miss any of my new videos. Today, we're going to be going to Walgreens and CVS. We're gonna go into Walgreens first. That's where I'm at right now. We're gonna only grab a couple things here. Um, I do everything on Walgreens, usually digital or printable coupons only. So because I don't have the paper coupons from the newspaper, um, I don't get as much here, but we're gonna go in and get them. The first product we're picking up today are these Bic Soleil razors. Um, these are buy one, get one 50% off today. So you're gonna buy one for $6.49 and the other one's gonna be $3.24. There's a $5 digital coupon on the Walgreens app. And there's also this $4 printable coupon from Inbox Dollars. If you don't have Inbox Dollars, I have my link down below in the, the description box. You have to use that to print your coupons. You get a penny for every single coupon you clip to where at coupons.com you don't get any money just for printing them. So another 50 cents, that's awesome. Um, well, anyways, you're gonna grab both of these. Your total after you get all of the coupons is going to be 73 cents for both of these. And then to make it even better, you're getting $2 back in Walgreens cash. So this makes it like a $1.17 moneymaker, which is already awesome. And then on top of that, you're gonna get $3 back on Ibotta for one of these. So it's gonna make it a little over a $4 moneymaker, which again, moneymaker on razors, count me in. The next product that we are picking up today is this laundry detergent, all free and clear. Um, it also includes Snuggle. So this, this week is on sale for $2.88. And then there's a dollar digital coupon on the Walgreens app, making it only $1.88, which is an awesome price for laundry detergent. I did not pick this up, but this is a really good deal if you're in need of a toothbrush or some toothpaste. So Colgate is on sale for $2.99 this week. You're going to want to pick up three of them. And then there's a $3 off of two digital that's attaching. You're going to pay $5.97, but they can get $5 back in Walgreens cash, making three of them only $0.97. Cents, which if you need some toothpaste or toothbrushes, this is an awesome deal. The next deal that we're going to be talking about is General Mills cereal. These are on sale this week at Walgreens for $1.88. And then there's a $1 off a of two digital coupon that you're going to want to clip. So total, you're going to pay $2.76 for both of these or just $1.38 each, which is an amazing price for cereal. And this was the last product that I picked up. It's the Hair and Scalp Walgreens brand sunscreen. Um, this was on clearance for a dollar, and I had a $2 register reward. So I was basically getting this so my register reward would apply to a product to make my out-of-pocket lower. All right, we are back in the car. Um, a couple things went wrong with that transaction, but it's totally okay. It'll get fixed. So I bought this sunscreen for hair and scalp. It was on clearance for a dollar, but when I checked out, it rang up full price, which I didn't catch until um, after I fully checked out. So they just refunded me the difference for this item, which was like $9.50, which went back on my card. And then the other thing that didn't come off was the dollar digital for the all free and clear. And I used a register reward for the sunscreen and sometimes register rewards will attach to something that you don't want them to attach to so unfortunately that happened to me today it didn't it attached to these instead of the sunscreen but it's totally okay i'm just going to call customer service and get the dollar put back in my account if you're a person that doesn't care about that dollar probably wouldn't do it because honestly it, it has been taking a while like i've been on hold for like 18 to 20 minutes before um, but to me, that dollar is worth it or else I wouldn't probably have bought these this week, you know? But yeah, so I'll go over my full receipt at home with you guys, um, after we do the CVS haul. So yeah. All right. We are at CVS, as you can see right there. Um, please disregard my messy back seat. Um, so we're going to go into CVS and get more deals than we did at Walgreens um so stay tuned for that and again at CVS I use all digital and all coupons that I can print 
from my house. I do not get the newspaper. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go in, get these deals. And again, we're gonna go all the way back to my house and we'll go over all of it, the transactions at the end. The very first thing you're gonna wanna do when you walk into CVS is go to the coupon center. Um, this is located in different areas depending on your store. Usually it's right when you walk in, you'll see obviously this big sign here. Um, you can either punch in your number or scan your card and this is gonna print all of your instant coupons or they're gonna print all of your CRTs if you don't send your CRTs to your card. And again, CRTs are CVS coupons, so they stack with manufactured coupons. First item is an easy freebie. It's the Sure Deodorant. It's $2 this week, and then you're going to get a $2 extra buck back, making it completely free. If you have other extra bucks, you can roll it so you won't pay any money out of pocket for it. The next product we're getting are these Dio body washes. There is a coupon on the CVS app for buy one, get one free, which is awesome. And then this week, they're also 25% off, as you can see right there on the tag. So the original price for these that you're going to pay is $6.49, but then there's that 25% off. So it makes it $4.86 about, um, depending on your store and where you're at. Um, and then you're getting one free. So you're basically getting them like two for four dollars, which I think for body wash is a really good deal, especially because I'm kind of low on body wash right now and I want to make sure that I stocked this up. The next item that we're picking up this week is the Optic White Toothpaste. Um, there's a different varieties of these. You can get the Colgate uh, Total SF as well, but I got the Optic White because that's what was ringing up correct in my store. Um, so these are on sale for $3.99 this week. And when you buy two, you're going to get a $5 extra buck back. I had a three off of 15 Colgate. So I did this deal twice because it's a limit of two times. So total for all two toothpaste comes to $15.96. And then you're going to take off $6 for the manufactured coupons that are on the CVS app. And then I had a three off of 15 Colgate. So I only paid $6.96 out of my own pocket. And then I got $10 in extra bucks back, which made this a $3.04 money maker, which is absolutely amazing. If you need toothpaste, go to CVS this week. It's such a great deal. Even if you don't get anything else, buy this toothpaste. It's free and you're making money on that. The next deal that we're picking up is off of the L'Oreal El Vives. There's a $2 instant coupon printing from the red box, which you can see on the screen right here. And then I also printed a $2 off of one from Inbox Dollars. And then there's also a $2 digital on the CVS app. So once all of those come off, you're only going to pay $2 for both of these or $1 each, which for L'Oreal, I will pay a dollar. I won't pay more than a dollar, but I will pay a dollar for L'Oreal because I think this shampoo and conditioner is pretty good. And then the next year we're doing is on the Pantene. The Pantene this week, the big bottles are three for $15. And then I had a $3 digital on my account, so that made it $12. And then I also had a two off of 10 Pantene, which made it $10. So that seems really expensive for Pantene, and that's because it is expensive expensive for Pantene, I would never pay $10 for that. But we are also getting a $5 extra buck, so it makes it $5. And I'm pairing in a four off of 18 hair care CRT. So overall, these and the L'Oreal L5 are going to be even cheaper than what they originally be because I have that four off of 18 hair care. So once I got extra bucks back and that four off of 18 comes off, it would be like paying only a dollar for all three of these. Or for all five products, it'd be like paying three dollars, which again, five things of shampoo and conditioner for three dollars, I'll take that. All right, back in the car from CVS. That was a fiasco checking out. So the first time we checked out, um, I tried to give them one last $3 extra buck. My total was like $4.82. And then it voided all of my coupons. So we tried again. And then I had two $10 extra bucks on my card. And those weren't coming off anymore. So we couldn't get it. And my total was like $21 out of pocket. And I wasn't paying that out of pocket. Like it should have been $4. Um, 
So that was a mess, but we got it all figured out. I ended up paying $7 and some change out of my own pocket, but they gave me back a $4 extra buck because my four off 18 hair care didn't come off and another one didn't come off too, but I was just kind of at the point where I wasn't gonna do it again. I'm not gonna check my car to see what came off and what didn't. Four bucks, basically for all of it, I'm happy. Again, we'll go over the receipt at the end because it wasn't actually $4 because we got extra bucks back. But gosh, couponing does not work out how you want it to sometimes. And that's completely okay. Um, the biggest thing is you do not want to be disrespectful to the cashiers. Like the guy who works here is super nice, super helpful. Um, he was like, I don't know why they're not working. So we got it all figured out. I ended up, you know, paying the $7 and some change out of pocket, which is total. I'm totally fine with that. Um, and then got an extra $4 extra buck back on top of what I got printed out of my receipt. So yeah, let's go see what I got at home. All right, everyone, this was my Walgreens haul. So I got two of the cereals, the all, two Bix Olays, and then this little mishap. So the first time I paid $15.72 out of my pocket, which includes tax, and then I went and returned this and got it for the correct price which was a dollar so my real total sh should have been 619 including tax and then taking off that dollar for calling customer service um, for the digital coupon that didn't come off of that which makes it 519 and then on ibotta we're getting three dollars back for purchasing one of these so minus that three dollars would be 219 and then i got two dollars back in Walgreens cash for this. So it makes this entire purchase only 19 cents. Again, I did use a register reward for this. So if I include that $2 register reward, then it would be 219. But again, $2.19 for all of this, you cannot complain. That's amazing. All right, so for this haul, I paid 766 out of pocket that includes tax but i ended up getting this extra four dollars back so it was kind of like 366 um for all of this which is awesome um i did roll 20 dollars in extra bucks so that would have been 23 dollars but then i got back 17. so again it makes it about three dollars for all of this which I think is awesome, especially because we got Dial Body Wash. Yeah, if you have any questions regarding any of these scenarios, let me know. So if you liked this video or thought it was neat or learned something, please like it and leave a comment down below. If you did any of these deals, I'd love to see it. I'd love to, for you to send me a picture, anything like that. You can post it on my Facebook group, which is Emily's Deals and Steals. It's the same as my YouTube. We would love to see it.